All right, so this is a suggestion via Discord. The name of the video is Animals Reunited with Their Owners After Years. Uh, this is coming from the channel Novella. Let's check it out. Let's jump into it, guys. The special bonds between humans and animals can sometimes be just as strong as a friendship Bro, between humans. Are you humans. A lion? Today, we are going to show you animals oh, no. as they are finally reunited with their owners after Bro, not seeing each other for a very long time. <laughs> Kiara, a lioness, is reunited with the man who raised her as a cub. A bro, no, this is a, bro. What is this? Listen, I get it, right? You, you raise some type of animal, one of these absolutely crazy ones, right? And you allow it to jump onto you, raised it or not raised it. It's a wild animal, bro. That is nuts. This is reunited with the man who raised her as a cub. Adolfo rescued and rehabilitated the lioness in his own wildlife sanctuary until she went to a larger facility when she grew up. It tried Years to bite would pass you, by before their reunion, but Kiara still remembered the kindness Adolfo showed her as a cub. This marine formed a lasting bond with a military dog after they spent every second together while on duty. And three years later, when the dog had retired, he decided to adopt him. Just watch as they meet for the first time in years. Okay. Okay. A herd of elephants run to reunite with their favorite human after 14 months of being apart. A joyful chimpanzee reunites with the people who saved his life. The chimp was found in the wilderness with seven broken ribs, and this kind couple took him in okay. so that he could recover in safety. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys. I'm absolutely frightened of all these animals, bro. I, I couldn't. The chimp? Bro, I saw the video of the woman that got her face removed by her pet chimpanzee. I'm sorry. Okay. An act of kindness that this chimpanzee will never forget. Oh. Oh, Aaron Morris's car was stolen with his beloved Please dog be Jolene inside. Animal. She was later found abandoned in another state, but now she's finally home. Jolene! Although his car was found dumped in a river, at least he was able to get back what was most valuable to him. <laughs> the dogs are fine, guys. Do we deal with dogs <laughs> hey girl <laughs> Watch as this dangerous wild lioness transforms into a loving kitten at the sight of the man who saved her life many years before bro get off the ground when this man was hastily forced to flee unrest in the Ukraine, his dog was left behind. But just watch the dog's ecstatic reaction when they're finally reunited once again. As two people were in court disputing who this adorable little dog truly belonged to, the judge decided to let the dog choose between them for itself. Be carefully. Put the dog down. Put the dog down. Don't, don't, don't. Exactly. Does that to everybody? Hey there. Hey, baby boy. Oh. That's all. Take the dog home. Hippos are extremely yeah. dangerous and unpredictable animals, but that doesn't mean they don't have feelings. Just watch how. Yeah, I don't know if I care about the feelings of the hippo, bro. I'm sorry. I can't. Look at it. All right. Look at the teeth. You understand how. You understand the strength of the jaw, bro? Why are you befriending the hippo? This hippo snuffles with excitement while meeting the man who rescued her when she was just a week old. <laughs> Even though he's got a new haircut, it doesn't take long for the chicken to recognize her close companion. Okay, chicken. Aww. Recognized you with your haircut. <laughs> Watch this emotional reaction. Guys, the guys, the the uh, the chicken in the back was absolutely disturbed. Like, bro, why are you touching this man? Look, look, right here, right here, right here. <laughs> 
Watch this emotional reunion where a dog cannot contain its excitement for the returning soldier. A woman working at a kangaroo sanctuary is embraced by one of the kangaroos after saving its life. Can I take some hugs to go? Jupiter the lion was rescued from the circus as a newborn after his mother, who had been abused, gave birth. Jupiter was then sent to a Colombian rescue center for okay. abused animals where he befriended the owner, Julia Torres. But unfortunately, the lion was taken away and brought to a zoo, where it quickly stopped eating and became malnourished. Thankfully, Jupiter was able to reunite with his adoptive mother and just watch how happy he is. A woman visited a shop. I'm, uh, guys, I am, I uh, trust me, I am trying to understand, all right? I am honestly trying. I'm concerned for these people. Alter ...and was looking to adopt a new pet. Instead, she found the dog she lost two years ago. Lost? What does it feel like, Debbie? Oh, everything I've ever wanted. <laughs> <laughs> After 25 years, chimpanzees Doll and Swing still recognize their old friend. An emotional reunion between two former lab chimps and the woman who helped them transition to a life without bars. You are way too trusty. Oh, this lion clearly had its own plans, until suddenly he heard the voice of his beloved owner. After six years of being missing, what? a miracle happened when this little dog finally reunited with his family. This monkey cries as he realizes that the woman who raised him is visiting after years of being apart. Look at those teeth, bro. Look at those teeth. Don't put your face up there. On the 4th of July, after being frightened by some fireworks, a dog named Dora jumped the fence in her backyard. Her family searched everywhere for her, leaving no stone unturned. But after weeks, the hope of finding Dora was fading, but the family never gave up. Watch as Dora is reunited with her owners after spending seven months as a stray dog. And this circus monkey tightly hugs his best friend, maybe one of the few who treat him with love and kindness. The monkey is part of a show which comes to town every year, and during the monkey stay, Miro, who is a volunteer at the facility, takes good care of him. Just watch how the monkey doesn't want to leave his side as Miro has to give him back to his owner. Truly heartbreaking. Ah, is he scratching or he's okay? Bro, bro, go ahead and give the monkey to the man. All right. Let's go ahead and give it to her. A schnauzer named style. Casey hasn't seen her owner in two years, which in all fairness is 14 long dog years. No wonder she was so overjoyed that she passed out. Too much excitement. But not to worry, the dog was taken to the vet a few times and she's all good, just very happy. Watch how this man calls his elephant friends from a distance. This man has taken care of these elephants in the park since they were babies. And as you can clearly see, these intelligent animals have a strong love I for him, I flapping their ears and creating a circle around him to protect him as one of their own. If like that they, isn't amazing, I don't know what is. Listen, it's amazing. I love it. I, my heart goes out to the man for, for you know giving his life for the most part to these animals at one, at one part of their life. I love that for him. But here's my dilemma. Okay, um, these are gigantic, pretty animals. We should be looking at them from afar, right? But once you start getting close to them, they can accident. Bro, what if? 
What if the the elephant, even the the small tiny one, was the well tiny is obviously you get what I mean here, right? Steps on this man's foot. His foot is gone. His foot is gone. He no longer has a foot, bro. See, this is my concern here. What if they accidentally swing around and like hit him in the face with the trunk as hard as possible, and he breaks like all all of his ribs? Right, it punctures one of his lungs or flattens it or something. As imagine, I, I think about these things. This is, this is definitely a, a nice, heartwarming video. Okay, but it's kind of horrific at the same time. When Limbani was born with ammonia, his own mother abandoned him. But the couple, Tanya and George, decided to raise the chimpanzee as their own, and Limbani will forever be grateful for it. Question, do they still have their face? After the destruction of many businesses in these difficult times, this pet store owner had to hand over her best friend, an umbrella cockatoo named Tofu, to a foster home. But here, we can watch their happy reunion after months apart. Her store has now been re-established and the woman was finally able to take him back home. <laughs> a woman that named Anita is, that bird is super excited. spent a long time socializing with a pack of wolves and a when she went to visit them after two oh, months, the pack was incredibly happy to see her. <laughs> For centuries... You... you I, bro, did you let that dog lick you in your mouth? It licked you in your mouth. I don't understand. Happy to see her. <laughs> For centuries, wolves have been characterized as bloodthirsty beasts, a misunderstanding that Jamie and Jim Dutcher oh, yeah? wanted to overcome by living oh. in the wilderness for six years with a wolf pack and earning their trust. Then, oh, yeah? after one year, they hesitantly went back to see them, not knowing if the pack would remember them or not. But luckily, their unusual friendship remained unaltered. Here's an unforgettable reunion between a gorilla called Quibi and Damien, Ew. the man who raised him and then released him into the wild. The zookeeper waited five years before returning to Africa to check up on his old friend. Come on. He didn't really expect Quibi to remember him, but he couldn't have been more wrong. Bro, is that a silverback gorilla? The gorilla was so happy to see him that he didn't want to let him go. A soldier coming home from deployment is met by her loving golden retriever, proof that dogs truly are humans' best friends. And that's all for today. All right, guys, listen. So here's the thing. We made it, <laughs> okay, we made it. And they made it also, luckily. A couple of them I was definitely worried, okay? The, the wolves, I, I have no idea why someone would want to, uh, you know, sit in a, in a compromising position and, and allow a pack of wolves to just, you know, run up towards them. Like, I wonder if they remember me, bro. Does it even matter at this point, right? Like, you like you have no problem being eaten by your friend. That's your thing, right? I guess, yeah, some people are different, right? Some, and some, also, some people also, like, animals licking them in their mouths that's wild all right those those animals lick all types of nastiness all right they're licking themselves as they're running through the forest guys it's nasty okay it's absolute don't let no dog lick you in your mouth a wolf that's probably worse maybe it may be worse because they, they may have just eaten something absolutely disgusting okay <laughs> like 20 minutes ago right you waited for them to be fed before you, right, hung out with them for a minute, guys. That was absolutely crazy, guys. Right, that one and the elephant and, and the lions. Why? And the chimpanzees. Okay, these are the ones that are just absolutely crazy. The hippopotamus, it was young, right? I was obviously young, right? So, luckily, things didn't get all, didn't go off the rails, but still, I would not suggest that neither. You know, a lot of people are different. Live your best life, right? If you just so happen to be eaten by your best friend... <laughs> Do your thing. I like that for you. Either way, either either way, guys. 
All right, the dogs, completely fine. But all right, listen, you guys all have an absolutely amazing day. Enjoy your day thoroughly. Guys, before we go, are you guys subscribed to the other channels? Logical Movie Reviews with Mr. L. Boyd along with Mr. L. Boyd Music. Both are found in the description. Check it out.